So join me right now. We're going to go straight to what they call the hottest shopping mall for Somalis, Caramel Mall. I'm going to see if I maybe get some henna done for my event and check out some abayas because a girl always needs more abayas. Join me. So hey, I'm hoping to see like some funny people at this mall because I hear people drink tea in the hallway. They're wearing the ma'awuz and it's like a little mordusho in this city I've heard. So I'm kind of looking forward to seeing how the people are looking inside this mall and just learning about what they're doing, hanging out in the mall after six o'clock. I think that's a thing to do. Uh, Minneapolis looks like a pretty, I would say it's not a small town, but the, the buildings look like they're older structured. So it looks like there's more, um, I guess the authentic buildings from the Midwest are still here. It's not really developed unless you go through downtown. Definitely smaller than Toronto, I would say for sure. But um, I guess it's, they're developing. But the most important thing is that Somalis are developing in this city and they're doing amazing things. And uh, that's why we're here. Sobaha. Okay, thank you. My taxi driver is Somali, of course. And of course, he doesn't want to be on camera. Sorry, okay, bye, come on. Hey, so we're just about to go inside Caramel, Sukha Caramel, and check out what's happening inside this mall. I guess some girls on Snapchat want me to come see them in there, so let's check it out. Do you know where I met Shehena Dalla Samaya? Kabda Hena Samaya Hair Salon? Hage? So how do you go? The other side? So walk outside? Yeah, walk outside and go left. So we're going to look for the henna girls we're, uh, this way. Okay, so so don't walk through here? Yeah, you can go my left. Yeah. The henna, the henna, the henna, Samaya? A hair salon? Yes, I'm in a, yeah. The other side of Don't get hurt. I can't believe this is like a whole mall outside everything. I uh, seriously, this is like a come up for all Somalis around the world. Okay, guys. Let's find the hair salon. Do you know where the hair salon is? Upstairs? Did you say upstairs? Nobody wants to talk to you when you have a camera, just to let you know. Should we just follow the crowd? What are we gonna? This is unbelievable. Look, it's outdoor mall. Where do you see this anywhere else? I don't think so. Abaya, do you know where the hair salon is? Gabdo uh, Ohenna Samaya? How do you go upstairs? Uh, you go through those doors and then you go through that now. Which door? That one? Okay, thanks. So we walked through all the mall. Now we can't find the location because there's so many stores. So we're gonna go upstairs and check out the henna girls. Let's see what they can do for my hands. How are you guys? Wow, this is really a mall. My <laughs> are you? You Alhamdulillah. Come. Is it upstairs in the henna? She's, she's asking why you were recording. Abaya, do you know where the henna place is? Upstairs in the hair salon? Yep. How get it? Up there? Upstairs. Okay. Abaya, is this where the hair salon is? What's the problem? Do you know where the hair salon is? Oh my god, it's so good. Is this where the hair salon is? Or henna place? I'm Amina? 
Okay, okay. Yes. Thank you so much. No Thank problem. you so We're much. We're recording. Oh. Say hi. I know you're going to get shy. <laughs> she was watching me on Snapchat. Now she's shy. Oh my God. <laughs> Don't be shy. Oh my goodness. How are you? Here. Hi. Just <laughs> ran into Roble. Roble used to live in Toronto and was a DJ. <laughs> Back okay? In the days. Back in the days? How long ago was that? My God, I was like a little baby then. Oh, it was like uh, <laughs> 15 years old. 15 years ago. Oh my God, years. subhanAllah. While ago, that, while ago away. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> but you did not change. Hola. <laughs> when I see you, I see your sisters, mashallah. Uh, <laughs> I see Bob. I still got it. I still oh, got it. Yes, okay, yes. You thank do, you. you do. <laughs> yeah, um, what was problem? your what's your favorite song to spin records oh, to? Oh, back in the days. Uh, <laughs> what about now? You don't spin any records anymore? No. What about that? Yeah, I just stop it for the sake of Allah. Oh, uh, mashallah. I mean, uh, one thing I'm so glad about it. Mm -hmm. I decided one night and I said, "Oh, Allah, I promise you that we're never going to touch those music anymore." Wow. The first time when he stopped playing the music, Allah give me a wife, Allah give me kids, Allah give me a job. And I have the most beautiful respect in my community. Amazing. It's, uh, my life has changed. And I will advise, advice to the brothers. I have a couple of friends who are still DJ, DJ Tiger. Yeah. And, uh, no, Tiger stopped. He quit? Yeah, he's Alhamdulillah. Yeah. Alhamdulillah. I mean, I will advise them, <clears throat> carry it off, it's about time, guys. I mean, uh, we need to go back to Allah. I mean. And I'm so happy, Allah, you're doing a good job. And uh, I was proud about you. Thank you. Um, tell me, and when next time, if you don't see each other, please say hi to meet you, sister. I will, inshallah. It's been a pleasure talking to Rob. No, so nice to meeting you again. Yeah.